You're looking for Sash. Well, she's not here. Allow me to introduce myself. Darth Thanaton. Don't worry. I haven't done anything to your master. I'm far too interested in how this game she's playing will turn out. I've waited a long time to meet you. An alien in the Sith ranks is an extremely rare thing. It never ceases to amaze me how narrow-minded the Sith can be. I wouldn't call it narrow-mindedness. The individual and the social will must be reconciled. There are no lords in an anarchy. I'm not concerned with your origins. The trials on Korriban are an honored tradition designed to sift out the unworthy. I trust they've served their purpose. I want to speak to you about your master. You don't like her very much, do you? Darth Sash is arrogant and reckless. The reckless have a way of defeating themselves in the end. When she finally self-destructs, be careful not to get caught in the blast. A young Sith should not associate herself too closely with a master like Zash. A young Sith can't get very far without a powerful master. You must seek your own way. Carve out your own victories. The culty one on Nar Shaddaa was a good first step, but it's not enough. A Sith cannot live without a power base. Good luck. My child, your power has grown since we last met. Your strength will rise and shake the Sith. I feel it. Now, I have another gift for you. One that was dearer to me than even my life. My own lightsaber. Until now, lost to me. But through your great power in the Force, I have found it. You must claim it. So where do I find this lightsaber? I entrusted it to my faithful retainer, Jonas Eskimos. The only servant who didn't betray me when Tulak Horde moved against me. He swore he and his heirs would keep it safe until the time that my heir would return to claim it. His heir is on Narshadar, working in one of the casinos there. Her name is Mila Eskimos. Go to her and claim your inheritance.